Hey everyone, Sean Ramjag Singh, producer on NHL 13. Today we're going to talk a little bit more about EA Sports Hockey IQ. In NHL 12, Luong was only aware of the puck carrier and doesn't recognize the other scoring threat in the 2 on 1, leading to an easy one time goal. In NHL 13, goalies are now aware of all players on the ice and can anticipate a passing opportunity. You see here that Luongo reads the pass, cheats left, allowing himself to easily get across and make the save. Watch here in NHL 12 as Bowmeister doesn't pick up the weak side winger who's charging to the net, allowing for an easy pass across and a shot. With the all-new player AI in NHL 13, the defense recognizes the weak side winger as a scoring threat and stays with him, allowing him to break up the scoring opportunity. Just like the goalies, the players are now aware of the puck carrier and the players away from the puck, allowing them to play better positional hockey in each of the new team systems. In this NHL 12 example, watch as the Sabres are allowed to easily break out to the neutral zone without any pressure from the Blues defense. EA Sports Hockey IQ allows players in NHL 13 to play within a set system and trust that their AI-controlled players will do the same. AI players no longer react only to the puck carrier, but now will react to the players off the puck as well, limiting the options for the puck carrier. We see in this example that Kopitar is forced to the boards by the Coyotes' defense and his passing options are limited. This creates a turnover at the blue line. Players are no longer allowed to easily skate through the neutral zone and now need to look for passing options or play a dump and chase style depending on the defensive system in front of them. With EA Sports Hockey IQ, we fundamentally changed the game by overhauling our goalies, our player AI, and all of our team systems, resulting in the best AI ever seen in a hockey game.